New developments tonight over a controversial incident at Whitney Young High School. WGN's Dana Revick live with that story. Dana. Well, CPS says an investigation is underway into this incident, and we have learned tonight the district is confirming that this history teacher involved has now been suspended. You teached history, so you knew this was a racist thing that you did. You knew no 100% without a doubt what it represented and how hurtful and how dis what disgusting it was. This image, which we blurred because of its offensive nature, was taken by a student in a history class at Whitney Young High School Monday. Michelle Donegan's daughter, who did not want her identity disclosed, heard about it from a friend, and then parents got an email from school staff that said there was, quote, an incident in which a teacher hung an African-American foot Football doll by a pull down string from a projector. The teacher indicated he found the doll in his room and wanted the students to see if someone would claim it. An African American staff member saw the whole thing. The teacher confronted the teacher who put up the doll and like asked him to remove it, but the other teacher like refused and it became like this altercation. No child should go to school and feel that they're being judged based off of their race and, and being made mockery based off of what this man did. And I think just a sincere apology and maybe some more education and training for the staff at Whitney Young. Today, students at Whitney Young received this email that says, quote, there is no room for bias based behavior in our community and that administration is partnering with the Office of Student Protection and Title IX to investigate. It makes me upset because we're like a school that's named after a civil rights activist. So like they pride us in being very inclusive and very diverse. So it's really like just upsetting that it's not like the case. It's just disgusting. It's it's sad and it's just my heart breaks because again, we're in 2022 and we're still dealing with stuff, you know, from decades ago. The Office of Student Protection held a listening session with students here this afternoon in the school theater to hear from them about this incident. We're also told about 400 students signed a petition for this teacher to be fired. We are told uh, by the district that he will be suspended for the duration of this investigation. Live in the West Loop, Dana Revick, WGN News. Thank you, Dana.